today at 10 30. Instead of having a huge party, I thought and I felt I needed to stand and hold every woman's hand, every girl's hand, every lady that was raped and sexually abused. I stand and hold the hand of that little girl who had her first sexual experience through rape. That little baby that died because her system was too immature to handle that horrible act. I hold the hand of every lady who got pregnant as a result of rape. That every time when she sees a child, it reminds her of that horrible occurrence. I stand with that woman that contracted an STI, an STD, or even HIV AIDS, and it can never be reversed. I stand with that woman that was blamed for the act. They say she wore a short dress. They say she found herself in a wrong place. But truth be told, the trauma of rape stays with the victim for the rest of her life. I only pray that God heals your wounds. I stand and hold the hand of every woman whose story was never told, but rather swept under the carpet. But the memory of it is still fresh in her head. I hold her hand. That girl that was raped in her home where she's supposed to be protected. I stand and hold the hand of that woman who was abused at her school where she was supposed to get her education and better her life. I stand with her. The lady that was raped at her workplace a place where she was supposed to better her life and become financially empowered. I can only but hold your hand and tell you that it is well. I know no amount of words can heal certain wounds, but my prayer on my birthday is that God heals your wounds. You are valuable. You still have worth despite what you've been through. And I know you can rise above that sexual abuse. You can rise above that rep. Because scripture says in Philippians 4.13 that I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Come on, rise up, woman. Pursue your dream because God is your strength. If God is your strength, nothing is impossible. And therefore, don't let that thing weigh you down. I pray that you will speak to yourself and tell yourself, you can do all things, not just one thing, all things through Christ who strengthens you. Woman, God is your strength. There is nothing that you cannot do in life. Rise up and pursue your dreams. Rise up and run after that vision. Rise up and become the woman you were ordained to be. My name is Christine. I hold your hand on my birthday.